This is Andrew Stotts of A Stotts Investment Research to talk about Malaysia Equity FVMR Snapshot. Malaysia in your hand every week. Let's start with the F in FVMR, which is fundamentals. And what we can see is that Malaysia's ROE is below the world average by a bit. We can also see that telecoms and utilities offer the highest ROE in the market. Dividend payout ratio is close to 50% and it's above the world by a little bit. And telecom pays out about 90% of earnings uh, in dividends. Let's continue on to valuation. And what we can see is that Malaysia is trading close in line on a PE basis with the world. And price to book is below the world average in line with a lower ROE that we mentioned before for fundamentals. Financials and utilities look cheap on an ROE divided by price to book at 16 uh, consensus estimate of 8.1 and 7.6 uh, and the Malaysian market's at 6.2. So if we look at momentum, we can see EPS growth in Malaysia is expected to be slower than in the world and Malaysia's one-year return is in line with the world in the stock market and also we can see that some sectors like energy has seen really negative returns over the last one year. Uh, there's a strong one-year performance uh, between uh, utilities and financials, which we can see about roughly 9 to 10%. So if you go on to uh, risk, what we can see is materials has the lowest net debt to equity. And we can see that there's also a very large net debt to equity at utilities sector. Uh, Malaysia has been less volatile in the world, especially in the past three months. And the volatility has decreased significantly in the industrial sector. So that wraps up Malaysia. Would you like to always be up to date to know all the numbers to be professional and to do nothing? All you have to do is sign up and you will do nothing and you'll get Malaysia Equity FVMR snapshot to your inbox for free every Monday.